Greetings, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another round of Adorize You Play Star Trek Online. This time around, it's the search for new Romulus. Thanks to our additional information from the colonists from Gazco and Helix, we've managed to identify several possible systems that could have planets for our colonization efforts. We'll need you to scan these systems, see if there is a suitable planet, and then explore said planet to confirm your findings. You're looking for what will be the future homeworld for the Romulans. We've also been told by Federation and Klingon officials that talks of an alliance could begin if we identify a suitable planet to colonize. Datan and I will be speaking with those officials while you're exploring. This could be the next big step in our fight for independence. Scan systems in the Beta Quadrant for habitable planets. Dewa 3 will now show up as new Romulus on your map. Keep this in mind when replaying this episode. That's right. A little planet known as Dewa 3 is going to be very important to us from here on. Oof! We whopped into a sun! Alright, first we need to scan the Galore Dun Core system. Let's see, the Galore Dun Core system is right, let's see. It's over. That away! Past the Karaya system. Bottom slipstream drive. Need just what the doctor ordered for this sort of thing. At least it's not gonna be too far until we get to it. Let's see, how far is it? Oh, it's only one sector away now. Galore Dun Core system is a minor annoyance. Gamma Aridon 2. Oh well, we might have learned a bit about it, but no! Coming right up on the Galore Dun Core system, it's... let's see... Come on... Ah, five, four, three, two, one... Whoop! Alright, hold it. Let's scan that system first. Initiating scan now. Preliminary reports are turning up negative, Captain. We can perform a more in-depth scan, but that could take nearly a week. Launching a satellite would allow us to monitor the area and move forward. Your orders? Yeah, launch the satellite. Let's move forward. What's next? Scan the Gamma Aridon system. The Gamma Aridon system's right next door. How convenient. Turn, turn, turn. We've got a planet waiting for us. I can't sing. Worth a darn. Space is really pretty now that you look at it. Seriously, there's the biggest chunk of the Milky Way galaxy. And out there is deep space, where no one has gone before. Now here, let's see if we can... Yeah, nice light show here, at least. Let's see, the Gamma Aridon core system. Gamma Aridon system. There's no core in the Gamma Aridon system. Except for the core of the star, which is a minor annoyance. Ah, here we are, the Hatoria Sector. Is that how you pronounce it? Hatoria Hatabuga. Come on. Right over there. It's this sort of time that you just sort of admire the contours of the spaceship and hope you don't crash into the sun like a bozo. Scan the system. We can't get a clear reading from the planet that Tamer specified. Our best option will be to drop out of warp and investigate the area. Are you ready? Right. Drop us into a standard orbit, people. However you do that. And it was loading, 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 forever loading in the... Yeah. Well, it appears that at least there seems to be something good down there. It's been some time since I replayed this mission, so I'm not sure exactly what's waiting for us. Either Doom or... Uh, well, since we actually found our home on Day 3, I'm guessing it's simply pain and anguish that we will find down there. But I could be wrong. I could be entirely wrong. I've, I really do not like these loading screens. These Actually, I'll make you a deal. If somebody... Well, there we go. Forget the deal. Never mind. It's all off. Ships, dead ahead. I knew it was Doom. Jamming our sensors. That's why we couldn't get a clear reading on this area. It's an ambush. <coughs> They're hailing us. Probably the gloat. Pirates like these only care about scrapping the ship for parts and selling any survivors to the Orions. Should I open, the, open ch the channel? Yep, open the channel. Want to find someone? Find me. Romulus! Wonderful! It's been so long since I've had a chance to kill some of you green-blooded sneaks. Now show some Garamba and fight like you mean it. You'll still die, but my crew could use the sport. Okay, I've got a red alert. These guys are annoying, aren't they? Let's see. Let's hit him with one of this, and this, and that. Siege destroyer on my foot. You're a minor annoyance at worst. Ugh. Okay, I'll concede that did a number on us. Keep firing, keep shooting. Let's see what exactly what this does. You're not gonna like this. No, you don't. Slow down, you jerk with a tractor beam. See exactly how they appreciate that. What the 
heck? What's our tractor beam doing? Get back here! I don't think the tractor beam did what it was supposed to. How about getting killed by Romulans? Huh? How you like that? I don't think you'd like that at all. Well, that's two torpedoes down your throat. Keep firing. Just keep firing. Otherwise, it's going to be a severe annoyance. Yeah. Let's hit them with this and that and something else. And come on, just a little more and... Natch. Quantum torpedo launcher? Yeah, alright. Might as well take that. Siphon frigates. These are annoying. Keep firing. Fire everything we've got. We'll need it. Die, die, die. Die and die. That made no sense. Fed the plasma. They don't have a... They don't have anything on us that'll allow us to bathe in our own crap here. And with any luck, maybe they'll fly in right into it while they're trying to... Take you to pieces, you ugly. And that's, let's see. One down, two to go. Keep firing. So that's you and you. I blame both of you for being royal annoyances. Oh no, you don't. You're not going nowhere yet, buddy. And if I back up just a little, I'll be able to hammer this sucker with the heavy plasma torpedo the cannons on the front of my craft, just like that. Ah, the class siphon frigate's not going to be much of a problem. Especially since now we've got this on our side. Keep firing. At least their facing shields are down, and now... Now they really don't have a chance in hell. And three, two, one, boom. Well... That was a minor annoyance, but if that's in the middle of Nausicaan space, I don't think that that's the best choice of place for us to settle from now on. What's next? Iconians? Yes. We were able to get a few scans of the planet during combat. It's no good. The wildlife is too hostile and the natural resources too few. Aww. That leaves us with one last system. The Dewa system. Dewa 3 shows some promise. You can leave orbit whenever you're ready. Sounds good to me. Let's get the hell out of here. Wait, maybe we should turn away from the planet. Crunch! <laughs> in the other news today, a large hull appeared right in the center of the... Let's see, Daywa 3. Alright, now Daywa 3 is... Well, it's a bit of a... Well, it's gonna become new Romulus. It's gonna be a much better choice than Gamma Arid and 3. Which apparently we just blew a big hole through. Gauge Quantum Slipstream Drive. It's going to be enough time to get us right where we want to be. Hello, Dewa 3, and New Romulus, or whatever you wish to be called. Crunch! Alright, let's scan Dewa 3. Excellent. Open a channel. Excellent work, Admiral. You should head to Dewa 3 and set up some orbital probes, and then beam down and investigate the surface. I'll set a course to the Dewa system and keep an eye out for any more Nausicans. Dewa 3 is one of our last chances to find a habitable planet in this region. Good luck. Understood. Tovan Kev, set a course for Dewa 3. We think we finally found home. Dewa 3. This could be the new Romulan homeworld. The radiation levels of this planet made it uninhabitable. But long-range surveys have detected drops in the toxicity over the past few years. Our orders are to deploy sensory probes to scan the planet. And, if they return positive, beam down for a closer look. Right. Let's deploy some of those sensor probes. Let's see, there's the target locations. Full impulse. Let's see. Probe Alpha should be right up ahead. Deploy Probe Alpha. Do -do -do -do. Splew. Ooh, shiny. Alright, probe beta. Coming right up. 
full stop as soon as there we go deploy probe beta and one last place to go probe gamma right up ahead come on probe gamma surely you can what the oh for god's sakes knock it off okay you know what you're starting to annoy me really yeah, like what he said, you guys have got to get a girlfriend or something, because my god. Hello, Siphon Frigates. You are getting friggin' annoying. Oh well. Keep firing with this thing and that thing and something other things. Well, Siphon Frigates. That's the end of the line for you, and it's the end of the line for you, because I can just keep firing and hammering away all day at you, boys. There's the frigate that I'm supposed to be firing at. Ow! Well, the enemy's facing shields are down at least. That's a good thing, right? Fortunately, you're apparently not a real warrior. A real warrior doesn't shoot at thing, prey. Who are trying to just find someplace else to nest. Thank you very much. Well, that's you in down the drain. Sweet. All right. Well, that's that annoyance down. Let's deploy that probe. I hope that's the last we've seen of them. The reports from the probes confirm that radiation levels have lowered on the planet. An away team without protective gear should be safe. Goody! There don't seem to be any civilizations down there either, but we have to beam down to explore the area further. Are you ready to transport? No. There are several teams that will beam down to other parts of the planet while we explore. Excellent. Alright folks, let's beam down to the surface. Let's see. Security, scientist, engineer, and a doctor. They all walk what do they all walk into a bar at this point? Alright, so, Daywa 3, let's see exactly what this place holds. Wow. Look at this place. It's beautiful. Ooh, pretty. Our orders from Tamer are to analyze the local wildlife, flora, and minerals, as well as any bit of radiation. Right, let's move out. Not sure exactly why we're trying to analyze all this stuff while. Well, there's a whole bunch of other people all over the other planet, and I'm a captain, and I should have people to do this stuff for me, but I guess I'd like to have something along these lines. Yeah, I guess I'll take a little more hands-on approach, shall I? Let's see. Survey the flora, fauna, mineral exam samples. That's you. What's this? Why, well, it does appear to be a cloud of... What the heck? Scan radiation levels. Ah, this must be the radiation they were talking about. Oh. There we go. And according to this, superior radiation report. Da, da, da. These animals could be dangerous. Let's just see. This planet is a lot more promising than we believed. It's hard to believe it's uninhabited. Yeah, let's... Uh-oh. No, bad kitty. Bad kitty. Screw off. Dumb cat. Well, at least we're not killing it. We're just sending it just running away. Deploying the Chronotron Mind Barrier against a tiger? Well, then again, not terribly surprised. Here's the Glub Glub. Take one water sample. Two. Yep, that's water, alright. Let's see. Uh, we don't have the, the, that's not such a big deal that's not important ah heading ahead right on so at least you can say a lot about this game but man new romulus is really pretty beautiful place what's that why well, does appear to be an octopog observe wildlife yup it's an octopus all right with a big nose So, 
What else is out here? Epo? What's an Epo? Where's the Epo? Oh, it's those little bunnies. Hello, Mr. Epo. Fuck, it's adorable. I want to step on it! No, I don't. That would be dreadful. So, da -da. ah, there's the out. You guys all right back there? Goody, goody, goody. Now, what's that? It appears to be gathering plants. Yep, that's plants, all right. So it looks exactly like a plant that used to be on Romulus. That's either a very good thing or a very bad thing. Keep looking around. Pardon me. And there seems to be water over there. I'm taking one water sample. And, yep, you can drown in the stuff, all right. The water is barely tainted by the planet's radiation. Can we just observe these guys quietly without... Nope, doesn't look like it. Ugh. Ow, these guys pack a wallop. Pow, pow. So now that we finally finished antagonizing the planet's wildlife, laying down suppressing fire, controlling a Protron mine barrier, is this really all necessary? Just keep firing, just keep firing. At least we're not killing them, or we're just scaring them away. Otherwise, this could be very nasty indeed. Take a water sample. Are we supposed to scare off the animals like that? Sure is supposed to be doing that, Red. It's our first time on this planet. Maybe it would probably be best if we just sort of left the animals alone. Oh well. Keep looking around. Sure there's more to search for. The flora, fauna, and water and radiation level. Minerals are probably going to be enough to just... Oh, well, what do you know? Observe the wildlife that doesn't try and kill us. Never thought I'd be so happy to see an octopus. These creatures are fascinating. They seem to absorb the radiation around them. Hmm. So what does that mean? It means if we cut one open, we'll get hit by a huge blast of radiation and die Spock style? I don't know. The high amount of lead in these rocks could be the reason for the lowered radiation levels. There's a thought. Lower lead levels means... What? This is Tamir. I've arrived at the outer rim of the planet. I'm keeping watch on any tall Shiar and Ozzikin signals. How's the initial search going down there? This planet is fairly wild, but it may be un it may be inhabitable. Yes, it would be best to reserve judgment until we have a full picture of the planet. Take your time down there and make sure nothing is overlooked. We can't have any doubt in declaring this our new home world. Understood. Take a water sample here. Yep. That's H2O, all right. Actually, it looks like grape juice, but it's not like I know any better. So, ah, there's a way out. Maybe we would. Maybe if we are real quick and quiet, we won't need to attack the animals. All right. Almost forgot about this dumb mini game. Hello, radiation report number two. Just keep moving, just keep moving, don't think about it. I am detecting ancient and dilapidated structures nearby. What was that? For a second I thought I saw something pop up. Oh well, probably nothing important. Scan the triodium gas, see if it helps out. There we go. Fire triodium gas. Hello, rocks. Keep gathering mineral samples. So, basically, this place apparently used to be irradiated as all get out, but nowadays it's much nicer. The combination of the water and the lead of the rocks and the animals that absorbed radiation somehow improved things. Not sure how that works, but I'm not going to argue with it. We'll head over this way, shall we? And it looks like there isn't anything over this way. It's a cliff. It's a dead end. We're trapped! Alright, looks like we're going to have to get these animals out of the way then. Sorry, guys. Whack, slap, punch. 
going up against an alien saber tooth tiger with my bare fists. Romulans are dangerous. Guess the mines got rid of him. He just went poof. Poof. And he'll never be seen again. Let's see. Gather the plans. Oh, observe wild... Oh, it's the little... It's little fuzzballs. Oh, hail our new lord and saviors, the Romulans. Hmm. So it's down this way. Doesn't appear to be anything really down that way. Let's head up this way and see if there's anything off in this direction. Aha! Hello! This appears to be mineral samples. And in these mineral samples, I gather, we'll find some more of the answers we need. What's over here? Excellent place to gather some plant material. Oh, Jesus Christ! What are those things? Like a friggin... Armored hell beast. Holy crap. Yeah, they are mature armored hartheriums. And a hartherium is apparently Romulan for a hell beast. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna chop you up into little bits with my... Oh, looks like the mines took care of them. Get back here! Let's see, gather these plants. What's in here? This fern seems to be resistant to the ambient radiation on this planet. It could be useful in treating radiation sickness. Nice. Real nice. So, what's over here? Scan radiation levels 2 out of 3. Looks like we have to head down there to get to the... Ra Wait, what? Is this... Nope. Yeah. I think we went the wrong way, folks. Yeah, we went the wrong way. Gonna have to turn around and make a backtracking over here. Make a backtracking? What am I saying? I swear, I can English! Ooh, pretty. Hey, there's some rocks over there. Hello, rocks. Mineral samples. Da, 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 da. Excellent. So we've scanned all the flora, fauna, water, minerals. Now we have to scan the... Is that a bridge in the distance? I'll have to get a radiation reading from over there, but... A little surprised. We should investigate that old bridge nearby when we're done with our scans. Right on. So there's the radiation. Da da. Yep, da 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 da. Yep, that's radiation, all right. Maybe we should leave. Observe ancient bridge from here. Okay.